Yo, hi guys, Kevin here. Welcome back to Forza 7. We are in an online drift lobby. Uh, we're going to be doing points. What's just happened? Oh, that's just brilliant. Okay, so we're going to be sweating out the points here. My car is looking disgusting already. Yeah, I've never raced this track before, so bear with me on this. Uh, I'm not expecting to come first either because I am still very, very sloppy with my drifting. Uh, new track. But if we can get anywhere near first place, that will be absolutely spot on. I need to slow down here. This guy is holding me up so bad. I'm not one for drifting down the straights, so... I'll try and get my points in corners. Oh, I'm gonna get past this guy. And this guy, there we go. What is this guy doing? I'll let him go past. He's racing the F1 car, like what? That probably put me off then. Oh no! A little bit of road sticking out there. Fucked it. Alright, we're definitely not getting in first place now. But this is good practice. Uh, to be fair, I think I have raced this track before. Definitely haven't drifted it. This is good practice. So. Yeah, thank you for all the love I've been getting. It's much appreciated. Uh, it's bringing back a lot of memories for some people. And it's bringing back memories for me. Um, so I can't can't complain at all. Uh, it's been a brilliant, brilliant to see some of you guys still here. Um... And yeah, I appreciate the support so much. Hey, this corner though. Oh, that corner's lit. Lee McVee. You can get so many points like drifting the straights, but not about that live. Oh, little love tap. I didn't get rid of the... No, I could just do this like the whole way down the straight, but it's just like... At the end of the day, I just want to drift. They really need to put uh, Fujimi Kaido on this game, man. Why is it not on this game? That game is crazy. That game? That track is crazy. We need it back. Uh, but yeah, if you want the the tune for this car, uh, it is in my Drift Garage video. <clears throat> Come on, just straighten up, mate. Just straighten up. Didn't touch him then. He's too busy flip flapping down the straight. Just wanted to get on his door a little bit. Yeah, we're quite low down in terms of points, but I'm not going to sweat these straights. I, I can't be bothered with that. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the new sort of new sort of episode. We're going into online racing. At least there's some people drifting in this lobby, so it's good to see. Uh, in terms of the wheel, I'm still trying to pick up a wheel. Uh, I think because... Oh, I just lost those points. I think because of uh, lockdown, 
like everything in terms of like home hobbies is just rocketed in price so you're talking like even like standard graphics cards they've just gone through the roof and then you got like wheels they seem to have gone through the roof and just anything that you can do at home that's a hobby just, like gym stuff and all this sort of thing just gone through the roof uh, because Obviously, everyone's like stuck at home. They're looking for things to do. But it's, everything's sold out. Even second-hand stock is overpriced, and there's just no stock available. So, bear with me with the wheel. Uh, it will be coming, but there may be a little bit of a delay. But on the on the, on the controller, I'm doing okay, so I can't complain. Oh, yeah, this is that corner again. Oh, a little wall tap as well. Alright. How many laps is this, by the way? Oh, it's done on time. Oh, brilliant. Is that new, I guess? Oh, God, I've got in there hot. I guess that's new, so the further you get around the track and the quicker, the better it would be, I guess. Or is it done on, like, a lap score or something? I don't know. But in the, in the leaderboard on the bottom left, it's done in points, so... I'm assuming if you just race off the starting line, get in first place, and you do more of the track than everyone else, you're going to end up with more points, right? That's a bit of a, a bit of a stinker there. I hope that isn't the case. I think Forza are really messed up if that is the case. Because then it's just all about racing and not drifting. Because like the whole sort of used to wait for everyone at the finish line kind of thing, that that community will just disappear. No wonder this guy is using an F1 car. Cause... Yeah, I can't see anything about laps, so. It must be done on time. That's stinky from Forza. Not a biggest fan of that. Really not a fan of that. Let me know what you guys think. Is it a good thing that they've put in? A timer instead of laps. Oh, obviously, I'm really late to fight. I'm like three years late, but I don't see that as a good thing, really. It could be done in laps, and then everyone goes across the same amount of track, right? Because if not, like the guys that are probably like two laps behind right now, they're missing out on a like, hundred thousand points. Like these two cars in front of me that are a hundred thousand points, they might have finished the whole lap. What? I didn't drop my tyres then. It is done like that. Oh wow, it just ends like that. So you need to just race off the start and try and get as many points as quick as you can. I wonder why there was like R class and X class and all this. That's crazy. I am not the biggest fan of that. So let me know what you guys think below. Um, we came fourth place, but I didn't know you had to race off the line and get as many points as you could. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, give me a thumbs up. And we will see you next time. We're learning. We're learning.